Hi guys, it's Carolina Helen from Samprema.com. Today is the day 16 of our 30 day video challenge and today I will keep on the, speaking about my, my story a little bit and um, uh, even go into a little bit to the mind setting and how it's quite easy to, to change the mind setting if you choose to see something funny and something to laugh about in every situation. So yesterday I was t telling you about how I got my diagnosis with the terminal phase of cancer. And uh, today I will tell you about how it was when I lost my hair. So I know many people that have has like quite a big issues with the losing their hair and uh, uh, especially with the with the ladies but I didn't really think about the thing of losing hair in that way like it, it would change my looks in some way even if it did but uh, I didn't really I have always been quite um, Quite a lot changing my hairstyle anyway so there was actually a lot of people that thought at first that uh, it was my choice to, to shave my head off or my ha hair off and um, so I was like probably gone uh, through a couple of uh, chemotherapy sessions already and I had like uh, this really long uh, thick red hair and um, uh, the hair didn't start to fall off, but it got kind of uh, uh, dead, so it felt like it was rubber, and it felt really dirty all the time, all the time, even if I was washing it a lot. So I ended up ended up to quit, get kind of sick over the the hair that was so hideous. So I chose to to shave it off but I couldn't do myself and I didn't want to go to a hairdresser to, to shave my head either so um, I wanted to someone special to do to the shaving so I choose to to take one of my best friends to do it it's uh, Monica that is Polish Polish girl um, and we have been friends quite a long time now. So she came over with his husband and little boy here to our place and helped me to, to shave my head. But a couple of days, uh, days earlier, my, my daughter wanted to do a little bit test about, uh, or test the, uh, like cut hair. So I actually gave her the scissors to do a couple of different kind of hairdos to me so she was uh, cutting my hair and it was quite good actually it looked good um, and while we was when the day was when we would uh, shave my hair my friend friend was supposed to, to do all the work but uh, actually the kids wanted to be a part of it so we ended up to make it a really really fun session we started with to shave my middle of the head first and we left the sides and we started to just fluff it up and I ended <laughs> ended up to look like freaking Einstein so I made, made a mustache of the hair that we had to clip off I may be putting uh, that picture here in the end of this video so you don't want to miss that um, and we started to, to laugh about it. We made a really, really good time for for that. It was awesome memory to, to make it actually a fun funny thing. Even if it got quite of um, emotional uh, when I well was shaved. So because not because of the loss of the hair, but uh, because it was a totally new level of me starting to heal um, and um, we got a 
totally new kind of connection with my friend also so it's uh, it was lots of lots of motions and my I saw my kids getting kind of um, emotional and upset about the fact that I was totally bold and that was something totally new for them to see and it kind of gave them to like the more deepness into that knowledge that I was really sick. That was something that I do a lot. I have made lots of friends but I also have made lots of uh, not enemies but people that don't really like me because uh, in the when I was doing my treatments I had a quite a lot of uh, uh, black humor so but that's kind of my way to get over obstacles and um, difficulties to just make something to laugh about get something funny of that situation because there's always that kind of side also in every situation if you choose to see it so my point of this video was give you an inspiration to to see if you can start to look in your life different kind of situations with little bit more with the humor i know things are not always that uh all pink clouds and uh, shitting rainbows and stuff like that but uh, just try to see something funny in every situation if there's not something funny maybe something beautiful so just give yourself the permission to make fun of yourself in different kind of situations and make the life count have a nice eve and have a nice day and my son is making faces <laughs> so have a great day and see you <laughs>